So uh, what is that you're holding? This is something new from Plantronics. Yeah, so we saw these at CES. This is called the Legend UC. This is a, a Bluetooth headset, which, you know, okay, that's not that sexy. There's a lot of Bluetooth headsets. But this one sounds exceptionally good. I mean, this is probably the best sounding headset I've ever tried. And it's got a couple of really cool UC features for, you know, business travelers. And then this is their Bluetooth speakerphone. So the idea is if you're using Skype, if you're using a soft phone, you just put this in the middle of a table and this little device will fill a room and uh, has some really cool tricks with its microphones to, to give you that speakerphone experience. Let's take a look. The Voyager Legend UC and Callisto 620 are Bluetooth-equipped, unified communications-enabled devices from Plantronics, designed primarily for the on-the-go professional who is looking for high-quality sound, UC functionality, and portability. The UC designation of both the Callisto and the Legend means that in addition to connecting to your mobile device, PC or Mac laptop or desktop, they are designed to integrate with soft phones from Avaya, Cisco, IBM, Skype, Polycom, and a host of other manufacturers. In other words, they've got the business traveler in mind. The Callisto 620 is a palm-sized speakerphone weighing in at about half a pound. It can connect to any Bluetooth-equipped device and comes with its own USB dongle, secured in a slot at the bottom of the unit. It also features A2DP, which allows it to be used as a mono speaker with your media streaming device of choice. Using the Callisto is simple. There are four buttons on the face of the unit that handle volume, mute, and call pickup. Two rows of LEDs indicate charge and Bluetooth connectivity status. On the side of the unit is a single three-position switch that controls power and Bluetooth pairing. Power is provided by a non-removable battery or a standard micro-USB port that also provides charge. Our test showed an average talk time of six to eight hours and several days of standby. The Callisto features full duplex 360-degree audio and directional microphones that are only activated towards the individual or individuals who are speaking. If you're using the included dongle, the Callisto also activates PC wideband audio and uses digital signal processing that cancels echoes, reduces dropouts, and cuts ambient noise. The Plantronics Voyager Legend UC is an in-ear Bluetooth headset that features an adjustable boom mic, customizable earbuds, and sound quality that is without a doubt the best of any Bluetooth headset I've ever tested. The Legend is contained within a pillbox carrying case that protects the headset and USB dongle. The case also acts as a portable battery and charger for the headset, meaning that putting the headset back into the case will charge the former, and plugging a micro-USB cable into the case will charge both. Perhaps understanding that power is the Achilles heel of any wireless device, Plantronics also includes ways to charge the headset when it's not in the carrying case. A USB base lets you charge the legend when it's at your desk, while a small magnetic attachment can charge the device on the road. Once undocked, the legend has enough battery life for four to five hours of talk time. The headset itself is a decent piece of engineering. It's marvelously flexible and the earpiece can pivot to either side for left or right ear use. On the back of the unit are power and volume switches while the call answer and mute buttons are located behind and below the boom mic. The Legend also features a capacitive touch smart sensor that can determine if you're wearing the headset. When you are, it will automatically answer incoming calls, transfer active calls from your phone or resume audio streaming. When you take off the headset, it will automatically transfer calls back to your phone, pause audio streaming, and lock the call button to prevent accidental dialing. I found the Callisto to be a solid conferencing device, even if the mono sound didn't impress me for anything but casual podcast listening. The Legend UC is a phenomenally good sounding headset that I found comfortable and designed just right. The ability to use Bluetooth or the included dongle on both products is a big plus, as is the DSP enhanced audio and the functionality of the Spokes Control Program. The Callisto and the Legend may be just the thing for the business traveler. The Plantronics Callisto and Legend UC are available now. You can find either for about $120. They're both sold separately. You don't need one to use the other. Correct, right. right. Yeah. These are individual units. And I like the fact that there's a lot of connectivity options. Not only is it Bluetooth, but, you know, you've got this dongle for the people who may want to plug it into their computer, and it actually enables more functions when you have this connected to a PC. Oh, and now, I, I noticed in the chat room there are some people who kind of balked at that this is a mono speaker. Yeah, it is It is a mono well, speaker. It's, yeah, and so music's not ideal. It, yeah, but it's not bad. I mean, this thing actually has... Let's hear it. It's usable. It's usable. I mean, if, if you're on the road, if this is what you uh, you have for listening in your hotel room, this is not bad. And then when you actually use it for its intended purpose, which is a speakerphone, 
it's really, really good. Is it better than something like the Jam Box, which is a oh, better speaker? Ab absolutely. Yeah. So, so much, yeah. I guess it depends what you need. You, do you need a speakerphone that's an okay speaker or a good speaker that's a decent, you know, okay exactly, speaker? Yeah. Phone. So yeah. You, you, yeah, and and the thing that makes us such a good speakerphone are the directional mics. They right. turn on and off based on what it's hearing. So it'd be great for a conference. It's really good yeah. for a conference. Right. Uh, now, I, I will say that uh, there is a complaint, and I did verify it. Some devices, I don't know why, but some devices, when they're using the Bluetooth connection, it sounds crunchy. Right. It artifacts really bad. In fact, uh, the, an iPhone 3GS and iPhone 4S hmm. both sounded horrible. But on my uh, Galaxy S4, it sounds really good. That might be an older Bluetooth uh, older headset Bluetooth profile. Standard. Yeah. Right. So that, I'd say, is a try. Of just because y you only want to buy it if it's actually what you're going to do. If, right. if, if you're looking for a portable speaker, don't get this. If you want a speakerphone that you can also use as a speaker, then, yes, it's, it's a good deal. And particularly if you have more than one person on the call. Correct. Yeah, correct. yeah it sounds like a great idea. Now, like I said before, this, the legend, this thing I really like. <laughs> it's, I, I thought I was going to hate it because it is big. I mean, well, there's two things I like. The big means better battery life, and that's right. the thing behind your ear. And it has a boom, so it's closer to your mouth than a lot of Bluetooth headsets, which are just basically picking up whatever the ear right. gets. So you get much better sound yeah, isolation. The person on the other sound, other side of the call isn't hearing everything. It's right. only hearing your voice. Right. The other thing is, and I know some people are saying, wait a minute, only four or five hours of talk time. The case is a battery. Oh, so when you put that thing back in the case, it charges oh, the headset, nice. that's cool. which is yeah, yeah. that's a, a little cool feel, feature. And it keeps everything nice and protected and, and all in one place. That is absolutely a buy. The noise cancellation, the, the, the noise, uh, the audio quality is great. It's got an innovative case, plenty of charging options. I'd say the only con would be price. Some people are going to balk at 120 bucks. Yeah, yeah. although... Uh you know, I think some people want something smaller too, but I, I think 120 bucks is is a good price to pay for a good Bluetooth headset. You can pay a lot less, but sometimes they don't sound that good. I think Plantronics knows what they're doing in this they stuff. Do. Yeah, Thank good. you, Father Robert. Uh, it's always good to have you. Father Robert Balliser is the host of uh, This Week in Enterprise Tech on Mondays, and uh, of Know How on Thursdays, and soon some other stuff on mm. our stay network. tabbed. Stay tabbed. Stay tabbed. That's what you say now. Yes. Not stay tuned. No, stay tabbed. Stay tabbed.